Time to get Monday drunk. This is Bush Light. It's uh, the lighter version of Bush Heavy, and I gotta assume it's 4.2% or something. And uh, you drink it, and you gotta have about 15 of them to get drunk, but the whole time you're doing that, you're having a blast. I love it. Mm -hmm. And they got this wonderful camo in case you're in a burnt orange wooded area. I don't know exactly where this camo would work, but. I don't do much of shooting, but I gotta assume. I do a lot of skeeting. What's skeeting? It's when you cram. Oh, okay. And Corey, what are we eating today? Today we've got Jimmy Dean's Steak and Egg Breakfast Bowl. All right, so um, these never look great, but sometimes they're really tasty. All right, here we go, another Jimmy Dean's product. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm, oh my god. I don't think we've ever had something from Jimmy Dean's we didn't like. This is super flavorful. Yeah. I this think is delicious. I don't, every single time I go into these bowls from Jimmy Dean's, I think they're gonna be trash. Oh my god, from looks, yeah. And I end up liking them. I look inward, and I don't like what I see. But that doesn't matter. They don't care if I don't like myself. As long as I tell them that this is good or not, that's all they want. Mm -hmm. I feel like this bowl is similar to having sex with Sean. You look at it, you're pretty sure you're gonna be disappointed, mm -hmm. but then this guy comes in just laying down the ramrod, <laughs> and you're like, boy, I didn't know he had it in him. Yeah, and you're kind of like the great value store brand version of this bowl. Mm -hmm. Cheaper, but you deliver just as much of a mm -hmm. ramrodding punch. That's right. Wow, I'm very impressed by this. Oh, speaking of dropping loads, I'm drowning. I gotta shoot this thing up with a little bit of Sixer sauce, dude. <laughs> I think uh, hot sauce and breakfast bowls. Yeah, dude, fire. Jimmy Dean sounds like the type of guy who drinks uh, Bush Light. To me, the name Jimmy Dean sounds like a guy that would like <clears throat> wait wait outside of liquor stores and buy liquor for kids. Oh, you, you know, all you gotta do, you gotta go up to, hey, you gotta, hey, Mr. Mr. Jimmy Dean. Mm -hmm. Jimmy Dean will get you what you need and he'll get you a 30 pack of Bush Light. As long as he is allowed to drink one with you in the parking lot first. Makes him feel young. Hey, as long as you boys are sticking around for one with me, I'll buy you some Bush Light. Oh, you, you're the best, Jimmy Dean. Hey, Jimmy Dean, if you ever thought about sponsoring us, just shoot us an email over <laughs> at hello at ever since we're cheese. Com, that'd be fantastic. All this like just cutting edge comedy. Mm -hmm. You want that in your commercials that are like, down on the farm, man, potatoes are real good. If, and I swear by them potatoes. If you don't understand our jokes, it's just because we're avant-garde. I was going to start saying every time I have a joke that bombs. <laughs> I'm just avant-garde, you wouldn't get it. It's like the uh, get out of jail free card of comedy. That's what Bill Cosby tried saying he was doing. <laughs> I can't believe how good this is. The onions look like trash. The steak looks like there's not enough of it. It looks like, like uh, when kids have those play kitchens, mm. and like you're like, oh, Jimmy's gonna go make breakfast, and it's like the fake egg and the fake toast. It looks like plastic products, but it tastes great. It tastes fantastic. And this is one of my favorite breakfast products we've had. Yeah. I open those up, oh my God, why? Tailgate. That's not how tailgating works. Mm. Beer and eggs. <laughs> that's not what they mean by that. You know what's really sad is that's not that bad. And not practical, you don't have a spoon. How are you forking up all that liquid? I'll drink the juice at the end. Yeah, there you go. You remind me of the type of guy who would like eat bugs so kids in, their, in his class would think he was cool. Please like me, please. Mm, that's really good, dude. This is great. Uh, potatoes can be microwaved. You wouldn't think like, most of the time when you like microwave something- It like, would go bad. Yeah, I would like every be time gross. we- What do we microwave in it? Oh, like any, like chicken. Every time we Ooh. microwave like one of the Chinese chickens, it's bad. Potatoes can be microwaved apparently. Yeah, that is true. It's weird, but it works. I am so satisfied by that. Yep. I got a hole the size of a quarter, dude. <laughs> You're in dumps out like a bucket. I said it before. That zipper's I'll say supposed it again. to be up all the way. You don't pull it through and just let it hang out. Hey, here. girls want nips out, guys want tips out. It's time <laughs> for the world to change, bro. I don't know. That's not Sexism goes both ways. Free I... the nips, free the tips. There's you know <laughs> I need to air my beast out. It's too humid and hot. My nethers don't respect them. He needs to kind of get a little bit of air. Guys, don't forget to like this video. It helps the channel a lot. Uh, whether or not you like your dicks in or out, it, what I do know for certain is that the more likes on this video, the more chances that Jimmy Dean himself sees this video, okay? And then he can see how just rip-roaring hilarious we are and how much he wants to put this trash into his commercials. I got a good question for him. Okay, go for it. So you know how you mixed your beer with your food? Yeah. What's your favorite 
breakfast food and beer pairing. And I know breakfast food doesn't usually go with beers, uh -huh. but in the tailgating world it does. Mm -hmm. So like, I like Natty Light and a breakfast burrito. What's yeah. your favorite beer to pair? I mean, that doesn't mean I pour it in, I'm not a fool, but right. that you did trigger a, a question for me. <laughs> uh, bacon, egg, and cheese on a bagel with like an IPA. Mm. I like to start my tailgate day with something heavier and then just like, then light beer, light beer. That way you can take a nap at halftime. <laughs> <laughs> but to answer your question, bacon, egg and cheese bagel and like a hoppier beer. Ooh, that sounds to good. start the day. Then it's all bush lights, baby. What's yours? Comment below. And uh, now we're gonna go ahead and do a shout out. Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out. That's right guys, we got a Patreon page. It's the best way to help us out as a channel. Patreon.com forward slash number six with cheese to check it out. There's a ton of great tiers on there. One of the best benefits of being a Patreon member is you get all of our merch early. You don't have to worry about things selling out. It's happened in the past. You don't have to worry about it. And we are currently this week, starting today and through Sunday, dropping our brand new shirt, the Sixers style shirt. And with that shirt, you can just rep us and look cool and have this cool little design that we got for you. So check it out on Patreon. If you're a Patreon member, you get our shirt before anybody else. Just uh, go onto a, your, uh, the Patreon page, you'll see the post, you'll get the password, you'll go to our website, number 6 cheesecom put that password in, get your shirt, be cooler than everybody else who's got to weigh it. They're all peasants, you're better than them. Don't you forget it. Yeah, that's true. Also, we do shout outs for anybody who's a Patreon member. Here comes two names. Patreon shout out name number one, Miss Christy Pollard. <laughs> Christy did the badass thing. She was like, I can donate $10 a month for a year, or I can drop a big 108 spot on these guys, save $12 so I save money, and then they get all the money up front so they know I'm good for it. Christy, a damn hero, $108 deep in hero-ness. Christy, thank you. And Patreon shout out number two goes to Mr. Billy Harris. <laughs> Billy also doing the $10 a month tier. He's just doing the standard style, dropping 10 bucks every single month. That's getting him access to all of our videos early, plus access to our monthly Zoom hangout call. So hopefully we'll see you on that, Billy. Hope you're enjoying all the videos early. Thank you for the support. And everybody else, be like Billy, be like Christy. Check it out, patreon.com forward slash number six with cheese. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and rate these bad boys with a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Eric McCluskey, drum roll please. Thank you, sir. All right, thumbs up or thumbs down on whether or not you liked or enjoyed, you think these guys should buy. The Jimmy Deans. The Jimmy Deans. Breakfast bowl, steak and egg variety. Here we go. Oh, oh! Yeah, that was fantastic. I mean, it's uh, just way more delicious than you'd expect. Don't let the looks f fool you. Um, it's, it's just great, man. I don't know what to tell you. The flavor's good. I think it's worth it. Go ahead and sag that. You're gonna enjoy it. For all the beefcakes out there, 15 grams of protein per bowl, dude. Only 26 carbohydrates. Um, a lot of fat. Um, <laughs> Jimmy Dean's, I think, just has a stronghold on breakfast food. Like, the breakfast food aisle, when you go to the grocery store, 60% of it is Jimmy Dean's, and I see why. They do so much good. They're the Goliath, and there's no David in sight. So, uh, that's a yes for me. Guys, thanks for watching. Go snag the new Sixer Style shirt, and we'll see you Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday for brand new episodes of this show. Back in the car tomorrow. Thank you for rocking with us. Don't shoot any animals unless it's directly to feed us. Sure! I'll have a drink. <laughs>